Hey guys, what's up? This is Carmen Fan 9 S Deuce. Okay, so next up we're next to the next next uh Friday the thirteenth movie and that is Jason Goes to Hell. Now Jason Goes to Hell I thought was okay. Um after I got done watching it, um I gained a little bit of interest in it, but is it my favorite Friday the thirteenth movie? No. But, I still think it's okay, I think it's decent, I don't think it's the greatest movie ever, um, but I can say this, um, I kind of liked it for what it was. Okay, so Jason goes to hell, Jason gets killed off in the beginning and doesn't come back, however, he possesses people, some spirits of his, uh, possesses other people's bodies, and what happens is, um, they start killing people, and they have this really long tongue and stuff like that. They get inside people's bodies and start killing people throughout, and Jason's not the serial killer. Uh, he is the serial killer. He just doesn't show up until the very end. And the end actually knows. Um, the ending was actually kind of freaky because and then Freddy Krueger... Freddy Krueger has a cameo where his arm pops out and then grabs Jason's mask. So, yeah. So, yeah, pretty much um, that's a uh, plot of Jason Goes to Hell. It was okay. It had some pretty cool gore effects. It wasn't scary, to be honest with you. The acting um, was mediocre. Special effects that were pretty decent. Not something I would watch over and over and over and over and over again, but what I liked about it was the cameo with Freddy Krueger at the end. That that was that that was a pretty cool scene, I will admit that. But you know, I liked it uh, for what it was. I'll give the movie a two and a half out of five. It it was decent, pretty decent. And, oh, sorry about that. Sorry about that, that was just... But, uh, anyways, yeah. Um, this has been Carmen Fan. That's my name, Kim Davis. Next up is my review or rant or whatever on next movie, Jason X. See how that goes. Anyway, see you guys later. Word out.